let me, you know, like nighttime, so, daytime. It's probably going to be nighttime. It's probably not going to be immediately. Um, well, actually, no, he probably will want to, like, just get it over and done with that night. Just tear off the band-aid. Um, All right. So he probably will send her a text and be like, just to have her meet him at the bar or something. Let me roll a composure for Charlie. Uh, yes. Six. Okay. Or wait, so... actually, diner, probably, because Castle would know Charlie doesn't like alcohol, I believe. Knowing Charlie's history. Charlie's never actually said it. I thought they went... No, they. you always avoided your history with Castle, didn't you? Yes. And Charlie has also, you know... Ca Charlie mostly drinks water, but people have seen Charlie drink the fucking Gatorade and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. Okay, mostly well... Fucking Nigel. But yeah, the... Ch Charlie has he never mentioned the alcoholism in any way. And plus, I, I just... Uh, you're right, because... Castle could never get Charlie, uh, or it's more of Castle gave up on trying to get Charlie to talk about her past because they were making more progress with other venues and he was going to continue on that and then loop back around when the whole sociopath thing was over and done with. <laughs> Charlie's a psychopath. You sure are. <laughs> Alright, so... So, he'll, he'll send a text. All right, so like evening or like proper night? Uh, probably around this like one. eight. All right. So I don't know what you consider that. All right, so that's like evening. So yeah, Charlie will show up. Um, surprisingly, she's wearing like modest bikini top sort of thing. Oh. Along with. But she also has like a bit of a jacket over top, like, you know, one of those light jackets that you can wear when, you know... One of the cover jackets that allow you to go into establishments? Yeah. Mm hmm One of those. And also wearing, you know, a skirt sort of thing attachment that's the same color as a bikini. Aww. Because you know, she doesn't want to just be, you know, wearing bikini bottoms. Right. She wants to be respected. <laughs> Slams fists. <laughs> Respect. Respect. So, she walks in, she looks for Castle. He, uh... He's sitting, uh, probably at the bar. Might have a light drink, but nothing too heavy. Um, All right. and he's probably sitting there. I, I imagine he's just in a casual t-shirt. Maybe, uh, some, like, uh, cargo pants or something like that. It's, it's decently warm here, so. Yeah. Casual. Not even cargo shorts? He doesn't wear shorts. <laughs> what? He's one of those people who just doesn't wear shorts. Um, but depending... Eh, he's on vacation, though. Mm. Here, let me roll a 1d2. It's the most useless 1d2 ever, but it lets you determine if you see his lower leg. So there you go. Wow. Wow. Or even... Cargo shorts. Odd. Just cargo pants. I don't have cargo shorts. There you go. Happy birthday. You see his lower leg. My goodness. No one's ever seen his lower legs before. Scandal. You have. I know. <laughs> no one's ever seen them before, says Charlie, who's banged him. <gasps> <gasps> the truth, it hurts. What you call Charlie? This? <laughs> So yeah, he'll see Charlie and nod. Slides over, takes a seat next to him. Evening. That it is. Alright, well. I didn't expect to see you here. That makes oh, two of us. Oh, that was a lot of sounds. Sorry, I tripped over my cord. Maybe you should sit down. No. 
That makes two of us. I was expecting to just go to the resort. I hope that my... And you just motions? This shouldn't be a problem, right? What is the emotion? Just generally. Just, like, us being in the same area shouldn't be a problem, right? <laughs> she takes a deep breath. No, it shouldn't be an issue. She waves down the bartender, and is Charlie going to get some? That's the ultimate question. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Charlie's mega stressed. You know what? Yes. Charlie's going to end up getting some. Okay. Charlie just gets something simple. A rocks on the ice. Sorry. <laughs> gets a um, New York styled iced tea. Rocks. Okay. Castle will uh, say after a bit. So, what did you want to talk about? Even though he knows exactly probably what this is going to be about. I wanted to apologize. Does not know what this is going to be about. <laughs> <laughs> she kind of. She's only taken one sip so far, you know, that it seems like she doesn't want to at the same time. Mm -hmm. Parker is like, this can help me calm down. She takes a longer mm -hmm. sip, sets, sets it down, and says, My last text message to you, I sent to hurt you. For that, I'm sorry. Is she referring to that I ruined your vacation? Yes. Mm. She's looking at him. I was, am quite upset that you couldn't say the words friends, but I understand that I very much in that moment had put you on the spot and I didn't give you enough time to give an explanation to help me to give one. Instead, I jumped to an illusion and then purposely made it even worse by making that comment which would have then I assume made you feel worse yeah it uh wasn't the most pleasant thing I can imagine that's why I'm apologizing, because I do consider you a friend, and I don't want to lose that friendship. Huh. You want to empathy him? You know what? Sure. I'll empathy him with my... Ten dice. Ten dice. I'll even willpower it. Oh, go for it. I'm at minus two, five, so... <laughs> five successes. Was it minus two or three for coffee? I'm trying to remember. I think it was two. I think it depends. Let's just say it's two, so you don't get as... the fuck. <laughs> yeah, you got him. Um, you can tell that Castle is... kind of... Genuinely surprised by that. Pleasantly. Okay, um, at least you had that there. <laughs> in, in the sense of, oh, you got a crit success, so you can tell he thought this conversation was going to go a lot differently. He, he was gonna sit down here and prepare to get absolutely chewed out. <laughs> and he was just gonna deal with it and then go on his vacation, so this was definitely left field she um, oh, you can on. also tell that he is uh, he didn't come here on the defensive 
he is very tired. And you can also read off him. He's pretty damn stressed as well. Um, but there is a sort of amiability there. All right, so I'll, I'll roll again. Okay, so Charlie takes another swig or glass, looks to you, like finishing it off in that one go. Seems that Charlie is surprisingly able to, you know, instantly. They must have had practice at one point in their life. Were those rolls for the alcohol? Yes. <laughs> Oh, shit. And she then I'd say that you know, you'd be able to always read it because you, you know Charlie well enough. She uncertainly, you know, kind of puts a hand if Gasso has a hand on the table, like countertop on top of that and says I'm very sorry about that words things understand I'm a difficult person to get along it's not that I need to be cruel or things like that well sometimes yeah. but Showing affection and gratitude are not common. She even, you know, kind of awkwardly moves hand away, like, I shouldn't have done that sort of thing. <laughs> where did she- I, I- you cut out, I didn't hear where she put her hand. Um, put, like, hand on his hand if it was on the oh, table. okay. Like, you know, and then, like, slips it away and kind of covers it again with her own mm. hands, like, shouldn't have done that. <laughs> he, he does not pull his hand away, for one. Um, and he listens and nods. I understand me in that situation. I mean, I didn't handle it exactly the best. You, oh, sorry, go on. Oh, no, go ahead, go, go, go. Okay. You tried to let me down softly. Too. You he know, it's... Charlie gets a second drink, this time found the ice. She kind of, like, tips it at him and is just like, it would be much simpler if you just said okay, I wouldn't do it. felt like it would have been crueler. I'm used to cruelty of people. You should know that. It doesn't give me a reason to be. And he drinks. I will go ahead and roll. What is it you roll? Stamina? Um, yeah, it's stamina plus your toxic resistance if you have it. I'm not including it because... Charlie doesn't drink all that much. <laughs> <laughs> all right. She I don't, I don't... doesn't like alcohol, but, you know. Do I, I don't have to take caffeine bonuses to, or minuses to drinking, do I? That doesn't seem... I, I, I don't think so. That doesn't seem... <laughs> oh, but evidently I'm a lightweight. Yeah, you're, you're a bit tipsy, apparently. I mean, honestly, he was probably drinking before she got here. <laughs> oh, man. Like that not, liquid courage. Not heavily, but he's just like, let's get this over with. <sighs> Five drinks later. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> what have I done? <laughs> she sighs and looks away a bit and then says, Do you consider us friends? Take a moment. I 
Don't worry about offending me. I got a lot of my anger out already. It's hard for me to say. Sips, care to elaborate? I don't think I consider most people on base friends, even the ones I talk to a lot or care about. It's a he just kind of motions with his hands like a trying to make a like a uh, idea of putting the hands together and like pull, pulling them apart is to signify distance. When I am, sure. oh, go on. When I'm someone's therapist, when I'm supposed to be in charge of your well-being, it's it's hard. Because putting myself in that situation is inviting a lot of potential problems for me and possibly for you or anyone. He shakes his kind of shakes his head a bit. It's just like, uh. <laughs> looks ahead. Howard kind of down in his drink. Charlie takes another decent sip. For out of your explanation, she was sipping at it. Mm -hmm. She knows it. She's finished finish it off. Gets it in front of her. Uh, yeah. Drank this much in a while. What'd she say? I haven't drank this much in a while. <laughs> Same. I don't like alcohol. It's... Oh, like most drugs, it's destructive. She kind of like looks at the alcohol and kind of like swishes it around before she takes a sip. I also don't like the burn that it leaves. I might be a cocktail person. Let's back down. It's kind of the part I like about it, honestly. Why does the burn remind? Does the burn help keep you warm? It does. It's kind of a. It's the same kind of thing with spicy foods. It's got that tingle to it. I, I guess perhaps I do enjoy spicy. I was going to say, and he gets another drink. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I don't want what I'm saying to make it seem like I don't care about you, because I do. I really do. Well, I guess the question is, why is there that mental block? It's not just professionalism, because as a profession, we can separate work and pleasure. And I, I did. I were used to when I first came here, but... What change? Says the person that caused the change. Jane has happened. Ooh, the music like stopping this. just then was so good. I don't like to... Speak ill of the dead, but Dr. James was a special case. You should... Charlie says, and then downs the next fucking drink, because this is like the second time in a week that fucker's name has come up. <laughs> this fucker... My god, she's a tank. She's the- I went down first fucking drink, and you're just keep going. 
I'll have to roll here soon. She gets that cocktail. Let's say the bartender's a bro and gives her a zombie because you know. <laughs> Second relief. So once you're tipsy, do you have to take any minuses to your drinking? Um, like I know Jordan does it somehow. What, like minus one? I I don't know. Um, <laughs> Two. I'm trying. I'm trying. I'm trying to. <laughs> Uh, drunk rolls. Looking it up, I'm sorry. I just rolled three dice and made it, so that works. <laughs> uh, poison and drugs. It's probably... Um, alcohol. Okay. Hunter Ricky. Okay, so how they how they do it, at least um, the anarch state, is that every drink you do, you fucking reduce dice pool for yeah. a lot of stuff. That's deep silly. Well, no, I, it's basically the more you drink, the more likely yeah. you are to get drunk. Um, yeah. However, I just don't know how to handle that once, like, you're already tipsy. And so I went ahead and just took oh. minuses. Yeah, so something I, that I see, it, it, this looks to be a, um, what's it called? Um, homebrew thing. Mm-hmm. But, um... If you fail it once, you get a, you get a mi minus one to resisting it again. If you get, then you also get like that minus one penalties. If you fail it mm -hmm. by like a lot, then and then if you continue to fail it, it slowly gets worse, but it's it maxes out at negative three. Okay, I can see that. But it also increased, but also according to the same thing about Amy, it increases your socialization until you're it. fucked. Until you're like just like shit face and, you know. And it no longer does that. <laughs> yeah. That works. Okay. Charlie looks at the zombie with, um, like, a confused expression of why does alcohol look so pretty? <laughs> And kind of watches Charlie watching the drink. She takes a sip, sets it down, has like that, mm, that's kind of sour look, then looks to um, Castle again and says, As I was saying, Dr. James was a special case. That didn't, didn't change it. I understand what happened needed to happen. It was out of control. And I let it get that way. Don't hold yourself to that standard. You and I both know he was manipulating everyone around. If you were friends or not friends, that to change that he was going to it around. Does make a difference. Can you honestly say that if you weren't his friend outside of work, that he, that he would have been manipulating you? Yes. Can you say that? I do. Because I would have been more resistant. I would have kept an eye out more. There was a certain amount of trust there that he used those outside connections, and I let him. No, that doesn't seem so much as a friendship as it does a toxic relationship. It was still a friendship, even if it wasn't a good one. <sighs> let me rephrase it then. 
it seems more like you're simply afraid to make friends because you don't want that situation to occur again. Which is understandable. Look at you being the therapist. I've been having to deal with Agent Legion a little bit. And while you need to remember, I'm, while not a psychiatrist, I do to read people. I do kind of read their intent. That thing is, it's simple concepts, just an application. Right. Hence, manipulative. But we all make mistakes. Oh. Say again? Oh no, I, I didn't say anything. Go ahead. Oh. We all make mistakes. Just because there was one bad experience doesn't mean you should hold yourself back. And yes, I'm saying this to be selfish, but at the same time, I'm sure I'm not the only one that's affected by this. I don't want to be friends with people that might become my patients or our patients. I can imagine there's only two people which don't fall under that category. Maybe. <laughs> he... You see a small smile come to his face because you're exactly right. <laughs> <laughs> One of them is an exception, but it's because it's a specific situation. Hmm. So you said it is. It's kind of a mutual therapy therapist thing. Well, I know exactly who that is. Mm -hmm. She says sounding a little bit sour and then, you know, takes a sip. <laughs> How come you get to be his friend but I can't? <laughs> exactly. It's literally that. If you want, you can I will empathy. I am tipsy. I don't know if that's a minus or a plus. I'll give Charlie a minus one, because they have drank quite a bit. Well, you've made all your rolls, though. But I have drank quite a bit, so only a minus one. Okay. Three successes. I got you, fam. You got me. And, um, you'd probably be able to get that. Um, Charlie's a bit sour. Like, they're definitely thinking the same thing. Mm -hmm. But it doesn't seem that they're sour with you. Just maybe if there's a hint of jealousy. Maybe. But mm -hmm. not a lot. But, again, it seems to be just in general and the mention of Janus and the mention of oh, the implication of Vulture. Yeah. Seems that... Something recently happened to Charlie. Castle's not gonna touch that. <laughs> Go on, Castle. It's his fucking vacation. Do it, Castle. No. No. Um, <laughs> so th does he say anything? He, uh... Or... What was the last thing Charlie said? Oh, I know who that is, I think it was. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I know who that is. Mm -hmm. You know, all that stuff. He nods, yeah. It's just... It's a complex situation. Well, I don't need the details of that relationship. No, I mean... My situation. She looks at him again with a, like, excuse me, sort of an expression. How can it be com complicated? Generally, as a therapist, you aren't supposed to be on any personal relationship with your patients. I've broken that rule. On well, occasions, but that is generally a no strings attached. Doesn't matter what happens tomorrow, nothing personal thing. Friendship's a little different because there there is a 
personable aspect. and honestly I would like to agree with you but he drinks he just shakes his head and drinks Charlie also drinks ooh ooh Charlie has failed um <laughs> She looks at an empty glass for a few moments. She doesn't get another one. She gets her water now. <laughs> Ooh, look at you. Barely holding on. He's barely holding on. He's tipsy. Barely holding on. He says. You have a entire team now to help support you. I'm so that's it's about brief. time. Most sites have an entire dedicated department. The job of that at site one three had to be seen versus Polly. <laughs> well, things are changing now, hopefully for the better. Pretty fast. I'll say that. You should at least try. Sites are, well, the most successful sites are those which are tight yet. I understand that. And I don't doubt it. I'll have to. He, look, he looks at Charlie. We'll have to think about it. Charlie nods her head. She's like kind of staring at her glass of water. Again. I... I don't mind talking to you. I don't mind having conversations. I like our conversations. I'm not at a point with anyone at the base in which I am comfortable putting a label on it. If that makes any sense. She takes a breath and says, it makes some sense. Okay. She kind of stands up. And then, after, you know what, after a moment's hesitation, she offers a hand to you, Castle. There's a moment where as she stands up, he, he kind of debates stopping her, as he assumes she's going to leave, but then kind of resigns himself. But as she... Also have a hand, he gives a small smile and takes it. Gets up. I'm sure. <laughs> well, oh, I wanted to. I'm sorry, what did she say? She, no, no, I'll, let's, let's say his thing first with, you know, got any plans and she kind of chuckles and says, well, first I was going to reintroduce myself as if I want to be your friend to well, start somewhere. Okay. I'm Charlie O'Brien of the Foundation Site 113. She has a bit of a, not truly a sly smile, but like a smile that like she thinks this is somewhat humorous. That Charlie has a sense of humor. 
He's so, f like, he's so fucking proud of you right now. <laughs> <laughs> like, I just, out of character, I just got a, like, in castle mode, I just got a wave of just, like, <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> Fuck. Why'd you get that, Bree? Why, why'd you get that wave? Because that's what Castle felt. <laughs> Let me fucking res cop. He's <laughs> good. Ah, uh, he... <laughs> he smiles. Like a... Not a small, small smile, but a... Hi. This is... This is silly, but also good. And also, I'm tipsy. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> and he says... I can manipulate you, Castle. You you're in my domain. If you do, you're terrible, Charlie. <laughs> <laughs> He's showing you genuine emotion right now, don't you hurt him? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to kill your brother, Castle. I'll kill you. I'm gonna make you watch. <laughs> he says. Hi, Charlie. He shakes her hand. Castle del Toro. <laughs> Fancy meeting you here. It is a fancy place. God, is it? <laughs> he looks around. I know they said resort, but... It's like I told Nigel. Perks are saving the world. Pretty much. I should, uh... Also be honest with you. Rumor. Well, you can be honest with me while we are having a lovely walk down the beach in the moonlight. <laughs> she says, you know, in, in, implicating all of those things because it's a big, huge romance stereotype, but there's like zero romance involved in how she says it. Mm -hmm. Oh, did I mention it's a uh, starry night? A starry night. I can point out some of those constellations, you know. <laughs> So can I. I have quite a bit of experience in the field. And um, it's going to be a playful seduction that. <laughs> You're fucking um, seducing me? <laughs> it's, it's playful seduction. It's playful. It's not like... It's not bad seduction. See? It, it's playful. It's only three successes. That's so wait. 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 I forgot. Four successes. What was that from? Um, the striking looks. Oh my god. God damn it, Charlie. <laughs> do I minus tipsy dice? I probably do. I would say so. Unless you're rolling the seduction. He, castle isn't very seducy. <laughs> He's got a six. It's not bad, but it's not great. It's not like this uh, bloody assassin slash spy over here. I know, right? Jordan's just like, ah, Nazara does this for a living. I'm just like, so does Charlie. <laughs> Let Sorry. James Bond and Mrs. Bond be a thing, damn it. It's Mr. and Mrs. Smith. It's a movie. Yeah. <laughs> All right. I'll run in a second here. Okay. You're like 50 feet away from your computer right now. I I might be cleaning some stuff. Ha! <laughs> Reroll. No, no, I got four successes. Remember? Oh, the little eight. No. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. He's charmed. He's a little charmed. Like. Obviously, if it, w it wasn't super serious, so he's not like, oh, I gotta go to bone town, you know, bone zone with that. But yeah, 
I mean, it's... He enjoys it. He Castle has always enjoyed it when Charlie is playful. <laughs> and Charlie. And not like, I feel nothing. I care for nothing. I don't matter. Hello, my name's Charlie. Takes out a knife. I'm here to kill you. Yeah. Um, and, so, and oh, okay, go on. He, he starts walking. He's like, after you. Just so you can look at my rear end. I don't know if that's something friends do. I'm sure there's some friend group out there that does that. There's definitely a friend group out there that does that. He says as he walks. <laughs> Charlie leads away, and she glances back yeah. to see if he and and then as she says that she's like, "Are we one of those friend groups?" She mm -hmm. says, trying to see where his eyes are looking right now. I got a roll. <laughs> <laughs> There's a good chance we're one of those friend groups, Charlie. <laughs> dice. Yeah, you better you drunk bastard. He's tipsy. <laughs> uh, he isn't looking, but he does say we might be. <laughs> then, I imagine, you know, Miss Bar has, like, direct access to the beach. Probably. Yeah, she steps out. He, he stops for a second. Like, I imagine it leads out to, like, a patio that has stairs down. Yeah. And so, when he steps out, he kind of takes a moment and just... <sighs> kind of appreciates the night air and the warmth. It's nice being able to actually enjoy the ocean. <laughs> she says it with implications, but doesn't say anything because classified. Mm-hmm. I always did like the Pacific much more than the Atlantic. No, but well, to me. Have What's you lived on? Well, one of them has a more fishy smell. <laughs> not be really Atlantic. It's not always like that, but every so often. That makes sense. I could see that. I've always been more landlocked, so. Well, Gary Indianapolis. Gary fucking Indiana, indeed. And any anywhere else. I've. Ocean was never really a big deal for me until. I don't know. I think I'm starting to appreciate it more. It's nice. That it is. She steps down some of the um, steps. Also, you know, undoing her jacket a bit so that she can be a bit more comfortable. Mm -hmm. Besides that, she doesn't change anything about her outfit. Yeah. She likes her skirt. He puts his hand. Even if it's, even if it's you know one of those uh, swimsuit skirts sort of things. It's a nice skirt. It's flowy. It's flowy. Like Charlie. <laughs> no, he, Charlie's rigid. He puts his hands in his pockets and starts heading down the stairs. So, what well, was the final straw to make you take vacation? I'm under review by the GOC of the UIU for my past life's crimes. Hmm. And also my conversation with a head researcher culture. Conversation? Well, as you know, I made a goal to confess my emotions to different people. Valtor mm. was one of those people. Him too? Yes. Mm. I decided you, Valtor, and the members of the team. And what did she say after that? I'm sorry, I didn't quite hear. Oh, 
you, Vulture, and members of my team, and when there's more people on the list, more. I see, I see. It went as well as one expected. Except for a fact I didn't expect harbor a grudge. Can't say I blame him. No offense to you. It's just the whole situation was messy. She shrugs a bit. Messy is a word for it. I told him, tell you the same that. My intent was to get the irregular termination. To me, it was just a bonus to get the full. I honestly expected that uh, I had to play hard hardball with you. Then things escalated. He just walks while staring ahead. Just is how it happened. Mm. It's just how it ended up. That it is. But I guess I can understand where he's coming from. Let's see, we're close. Say again? The two were close. That's what he said. I don't know so much about that. There's. I think he thought they were close, but I don't think it's true. But it's more so how he feels, which I think I can understand. Nods. I was worried about him for a while. It's good he has someone to call a friend other than his little social group. Even if it is hindering him. And when she say that, you can practically feel her eye roll. Hindering? You know my outlook on emotions. They make people make illogical choices, things like that. And even after all this therapy and uh -huh. such, you still don't think emotions Wait, are good. Did I say that? Yeah. She pauses and turns to look at him, crosses her arms, and says, Emotions have their place, it's just that. Well, maximum efficiency requires no emotions, correct? Uh, I would disagree. Robots are efficient. They don't have emotions. Robots can't make inf uh, informed decisions. That's wrong, and you know it. That is not wrong. There's a reason that everything Romero was she... running went down in flames. You know as well as I do that Pony did not go down in flames. She was just unplugged because everyone was afraid of her. Pony didn't understand people. Correct. And that led to several problems. That it did. But she was very good at what she did. She made plenty of informed decisions. But, and then she shakes her head and says, I just grass, I'm trying to have an argument. Uh, here's the thing. Emotions have their place. I understand. And I think if someone isn't a robot, uh, by any means necessary, if they are a person who breathes, they deserve to have emotions and feelings, regardless of their... He just raises his hands and let them fall to his side. Which is Stand. why I'm happy that a vulture has a friend. He's a, he's a saint, honestly. He, he, he'll start walking again. Like, for a second there, he was like, huh, I'm gonna fight you, Charlie. And he's like, ah, my fire's gone, I'm good. 
you, you also get the entire feel like Charlie was. Charlie's a very argumentative person. She needs to be right. Mm -hmm. Charlie ended that conversation. Technically, she's right. Technically, so she won. <laughs> um, that's how Charlie views it. Castle just he he, just, uh, he he moved on with the wind. He's he's a little tipsy right now, and he just doesn't care enough. <laughs> yep. There's. Wait, what was the last thing he said? I... Uh, we don't deserve him, honestly. Uh, she chuckles a bit and says. Well, don't know so much about that, but I'm glad Site 3 has him. I agree. I've got an ongoing promise to kick his ass in mini golf. Problem is, the bastard's really good at mini golf. I'd imagine he is. Mini golf is a just hand eye coordination. It's ridiculous. I could maybe beat him at mini golf. Maybe. You could be. Looks at Charlie. Just like. Like, she, she got a contemplating look of, like, could I beat Vulture at mini golf? And then, like, after. If he doesn't say anything after a few moments, she shakes and says, no, I, I don't think I can beat him at mini golf. Oh, could you beat me at mini golf? Maybe. I'm sure they have a putt putt arena somewhere here. They do. They have golf in here, I checked. I was gonna oh, practice. Golfing. They have mini golf too. Well, but do you want to go trip to that while we're a little bit tipsy? Great, no, no, I can't focus. I can't get a good putt in while I'm f floating. Oh, that seems like the best time to do it, then. That way I can win. No, no, I, I want to beat you fair and square. Well, I'm also a little bit tipsy as well, so it's fair. And then she rolls persuasion. <laughs> persuade you to play the Um Manipulate persuasion. And I'm going to take my negative. So it's just 10. Oh! <laughs> I re-roll. No, come on. It's vacation. What the hell? <laughs> we need to play mini golf while we're drunk. She has a bit of a, you know, cheeky grin, kind of like goading him, like, you know, if you don't want to play because you're afraid of losing, I understand. No, well, I'm not going to lose. Well, it's a shame that we'll never be able to find him because he didn't even know. Uh, he kicks sand at her. <laughs> <laughs> like, not, not like high, but like in her direction. looks at him with a expression of, excuse me. How about this? We're she gonna play mini golf. Faces him. Shh. <laughs> Steps forward. <laughs> Eyebrows go up like you shush me. <laughs> <laughs> she, she did shush you. Why don't we make this mini golf more interesting? Okay. I was going to suggest shots, but I don't like to do any shots. If you still want to do shots, fair enough. Yeah. What but else do you have in mind? For every time you lose a hole, we'll, we'll do it based upon holes. Okay. The other has to honestly reveal. something close to them. It doesn't need to be super dark and scary or something like that. Just something. What about both? Shots and that? Sure. Charlie needs to make a res comp. <laughs> because I'll Roll be gods are in your favor. I'll be honest with you, Charlie. If we're doing that, I do not want to be sober enough to think about the things I'm saying. All right. 
fine. Lead the way to the mid to the putt putt. Why do you call it putt putt? <laughs> he starts walking. It's called putt putt. That's it's called what it's mini called. golf. Yes, but you're using a small putt to putt the, the, the small a ball small into the hole. <laughs> yes, it's a small putt. Are you were describing the the putter. It's small. I don't know, it just makes it sound so... It's at this moment that you might realize that uh, Charlie hasn't played mini-golf in a very long time. <laughs> he continues walking. Alright, so... How many games are we doing here? How many, uh... Let's, f let's flatten out the rules. Well, I imagine we only need to do one game. It's what, 20 holes, 18 holes, something like that? There's so many. Sure. 18 holes. Alright. Oh. 18 holes, mini y'all. Alright. Prepare to lose. I'm prepared to win. I am a professional at getting in holes. <laughs> and he just continues. She raises a brow at that. To the mini golf. Charlie also goes to the mini golf. She gets her favorite colored ball. <laughs> Purple. Holy shit. What? I was going to have Castle get his favorite color as well, which is also purple. What the hell, Charlie? Uh, so, so, do they both just grab a purple ball and just look at each other? Let's go for it. Look. Oh, I insist. No, 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 ladies first. Squints ever so lightly and takes the ball. <laughs> he won't take a uh, red ball. Oh, that's Charlie's second favorite color. <laughs> <laughs> is, is that Castle's second favorite color? I think Castle's favorite second favorite color is blue. Oh, okay, I was, I was just about to laugh. Nah, red's a bit too bright for him. Uh, and so he takes it. Uh, what, what is a mini golf oh. for all? Um, maybe Dex Athletics. Oh lord. Okay. So... Or maybe we can even say Wits Athletics. I like Wits Athletics, that gives me more dice. <laughs> so, well, you see, either way it's the exact same for me, but... Mm. I'm, I'm like, well, you... You need some skill with a putter, but it, it really do. does come to bouncing corners. And that's the real thing of mini golf. Mm -hmm, so, mm -hmm. and so the athletics can be the hitting the ball, whereas the wits is the figuring it out. I like it. All right. All right. And he'll he'll let Charlie go first. Charlie actually takes out a coin, says heads or tails. Tails. She flips it. Um, let's say odd is heads, even, even is tails. Okay, tails. So mm -hmm. it lands on the ground. Charlie looks at it. Tails. She pockets her. I still got it. And he will go ahead and putt. God, I have so many minuses, Charlie. This isn't fair. <laughs> Charlie is holding on to the, like, you know, checkboard thing to see how many it takes to, you know, right, for you so to get it in. Minus four. Two for tipsy, two for coffee. Let's go. <laughs> Jesus. Almost a crit fail. Amazing. Um, Charlie's is a nine. I'll say that, you know, do you want to say that um, they got all of the drinks? prior to getting to mini golf. Yeah, let's just say that. Okay. And at some point, I'll probably include Charlie's. When the, when all the drinks that Charlie made hit him, I'll, I'll make him do another roll. Mm -hmm. Just, you know, bear it out a bit. Okay, three successes. Oh, I didn't mean to click that again, sorry. <laughs> we won't take that one. I mean, it'd be you get it in the hole and it takes Castle a couple more tries. 
five, six. Are you sure you're good at this? She says, marking it down, him down at seven while she gets it within like two shots. He flips her off. <laughs> <laughs> well, take your shot and tell me something meaningful. Okay. He looks at Jake, swirls it, take shot. I will roll. I only have three fucking dice. Oh god. <laughs> He's good, he's good. He's good, guys, he's good. Alright, he takes a shot and he's like, Should we have just a, a topic in which we do these, or just top of head? <laughs> what do you want to do? I don't know. I'm having to come up with a random meaningful fact on the spot. That's why I'm asking. <laughs> well, let's have a topic right now. You know what? No, let's just keep it. Keep it random? Okay. Keep it random. Makes it more exciting. Random meaningful fact. About castle. About castle. Okay. I, I don't really care if the pandas are dying. <laughs> okay, okay. My mother taught us to speak Spanish in the home, but she never taught me how to write it. Do you want to learn how to write it? She says, moving to the next hole. Maybe someday. I could probably teach you. She sets down her ball. It shouldn't she be goes to what? I, I heard bright. You speak Spanish. Speak it fluently. You heard it the on the phone. Only one success. Can you beat Charlie? I don't know. I got five dice. <laughs> God damn. damn. It takes Charlie a, set, a couple times. The windmill fucks with Charlie. She's like, but she gets it through the first. <laughs> he, he misses again. And you see him just silently staring at the vault. It's just not there. And he's just like, fuck. Fuck. <laughs> he looks at Charlie before he goes again. I swear, when I'm sober, I'm better at this. Well, we'll have to try again when you're sober. Alright, what am I at? Like 12 points? Um, actually, no, 9. 9? For this wall. Okay. I'll... In total, you're. Don't worry, I'll catch up on the later rounds. I just needed to get more difficult. Give me my shot. <laughs> She hands with shot. Alright, down the hatch. Imagine it's just like two shot glasses. And then there's, you know, a, a couple bottles they fill. <laughs> yeah, he, he just takes it and downs it. <sighs> Meaningful fact number two. Oh, right, shot okay, glass. okay. Meaningful fact number two about castle. Yes. These are hard to come with uh, up, up without the spot. I feel like I should have thought about this more. Well, we, we were walking in, towards this area. You could find it then. And it's then. I guess. I'm not a big fan of sweets, but I do like baking. Hmm. With the exception of for sweets, angel, fruitcake, and uh, not chocolate, but only if it has whipped cream and marshmallows. Any other sweets I can't do. She nods a bit. Does that count? I'd say so. That's a full fact. Alright, that's the last fact you're getting. I'm not missing any of these other holes. If you say so. I, you gotta, you go, oh, Jesus. <laughs> so I, not, I imagine this one, you know. Charlie puts her ball down, waits for a moment. If you say so. Tush, hole in one. She then looks at him with a, uh... Oh, oh. If, since you got more, 
but it wasn't a hole in one. It was a. It slips right up to it, almost there though. And then Castle. Castle hits knocks. it, and it goes in the hole in one, and he just smirks at her. I am. Oh, maybe you're right. I am a man of my word. She takes her sip. Ooh. <laughs> Bottoms up. Interesting, Charlie. Fact that's meaningful. Numero uno. Number one. You already know I like nature, so I can't say that as yeah. a compound. You threw that one out. You gave it to me I did. early. I like sunsets. They are calming, beautiful, and they let me know that a new day's on the horizon. Quite literally. It's both the end and the beginning of something. So that would show up in your patient or in your paintings a lot. Yes. It's also to have most of my favorite colors. Well, you get to go first because you finally beat me to one of these. Fine, we're, points. we're three holes in. Well, yes, I'm I know, three holes in. Almost 50%. Almost 50%. Still a final eight. You know how long it took you last time? Uh, yeah, yeah, I keep gloating in your one extra hole. <laughs> Two successes. Oh, oh, wait, no. That's the wrong hole. Um, what was I at? <laughs> I was at nine, so I need to roll five more. <laughs> Takes Charlie a bit longer to get it in. The difficulty of the course is starting to get to him. There's like a little hop, but if, if you go too much, you miss. You just go off the board and you go restart. That got you, Charlie. Charlie's like, oh, I, I got this, but it hit too hard. Too much force. I know. Second time, though, she has it. See, I know what I'm doing. Mm-hmm. Yep, proved it. He holds up the uh, the thing with the shots on it. She takes her shot. <sighs> All right. Interesting, Charlie. Fact number two. Number two. Now that we've caught up. I'm not a big ant person, but not a big I do what like person. I'm sorry, I didn't hear. Animal, but I do like birds and wolves. Birds because, well, they normally do their own thing. They're very pretty things. Wolves just because, well, I like. I don't need to justify that that at all. Mm -hmm. Just as Agent Leech would say, they're cool. That's exactly what Agent Leech would say. Well, here we go. Alright. should Gosh. be glad I'm going easy on you. Going easy on me? Oh, shut it. <laughs> you are not. No lying, Charlie. You can't lie. It's a joke. I know. <laughs> Charlie can get away with some jokes. <laughs> Let me joke. <laughs> Three successes. Fuck god, with five dice. <laughs> so, I, I assume we're close on this one. This is like probably, you know, the tube one. Oh, yeah. So it's like... Because it, it... just because we win doesn't mean they're whole in ones. Maybe it's... Yeah. Like, the, the success difference is how many less it took for them to get it in or something. I I, I like to think of it like, um, it's, you know, based on the, um, so, like, three is, like, a crit success, five is, like, a higher crit, so forth. Like, a three, you did fucking great. A five, that's, like, basically a whole of one. I see, yeah, I think that, like, three is, like, birdie, maybe. Yeah, yeah. 
but you know if someone gets higher than like someone else then we can be like oh and you know change it around a bit yeah so yeah, the castles now beating is you know <laughs> charlie still has more points overall because that was a couple of times oh, but, God. Um, but you know we're, we're not playing we're not counting points we're counting holes yeah we're we're not counting points. We're counting who gets it in first. I like I like their ways of gloating, though. Charlie's way of gloating is reminding Castle of his shitty score. <laughs> yeah. So so yeah, so Charlie's just like you know just to put Castle back in his place. Well, I I still have a better point value. Yeah, not if you keep it up at this rate. <laughs> it's it's okay. I know you. I know you're going easy on me, thank you. Look at these shot rolls. These, these two are going strong. They're going strong. Interesting fact number three. Alright. I like the ocean. But that's kind of a cop-out. So I'll also include that I like the ocean because it's... To me, it's calming and at the same time awe-inspiring. Just imagining the force of it. It's also why I like to paint the ocean. Mm -hmm. I like looking at the ocean. I'm just gonna give this to you. I'm not gonna use this. I feel like it's a cop up. Uh, well, it's oh. why, why I explain myself better. <laughs> no, but he looks over at the ocean. I think it's nice to look at. I wouldn't swim in it. Don't like the water? Uh, water's fine as the current, I think. I don't want to be pulled under. Well. Thankfully, this area, I'm quite certain, is safe. If you really want, I can hold your hand, you big baby. <laughs> Says with a bit of smirk. Gestures for him to putt. Now you're just being rude. Also, I don't think I get as much traction while swimming now. And he kind of waves his skeleton hand before he putts. Just walk around in a shallow water. That isn't I swimming. <laughs> Two successes. I bet you can pick up a sea urchin now. Fuck! <laughs> Did that was that Charlie? <laughs> yeah, so Ch Ch Charlie is, you know, putting and then just like, fuck! <laughs> I'm going to go up there and I'm going to beat you with a stick. Stop, come on, we're supposed to be on good terms. Oh, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a fat angle. The moon was in your eyes. It's not how this works at all. Let you me make that. excuses for you. Because <laughs> this is. She takes her shot begrudgingly. Alright. Interesting Charlie fact number four. Um. I inherited a lot of my biological father's traits. Um, I also did learn a bit of elect electrical work. From him, which is why I am, uh, you know, decent with explosives. And along with other things, I did manage to learn much, quite a bit before everything went down with him. Mm -hmm. Yeah, two to four. There's your interesting fact. Now, put them so I can. So Reassure can... my score lead. So you can take another shot. <laughs> he puts. Oh shit. See? Right where I belong. Well, I suppose two successes. He gets it in eventually. It's not zero successes, but. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just. Well. I'm not going to retract my confidence yet. I'm still winning, he says as he takes the, uh drink right, up. these rolls <laughs> luck god 
And he says, alright. Interesting castle fact number three. I wasn't originally a uh, combat medic. I started in the Marines and uh, applied to be transferred out. Well, I'm sure if there's more to that story. Yeah, I can tell you if you want. You can while I destroy you at this game. Mm, destroy. Sure. It's, it, it's not too great. She's like, oh no. <laughs> you might be able to catch up with this. But she doesn't let that show. So, I, and this is putting, he says, I, uh, before I became a 68W, I went into the Marines and I was with them for going on a little bit of a year to a year and a half. And I just realized that I was not going to be good in that field. And there were transfers available uh, for people who could fill that position. Um, and so I, I did that. I was part of the Marines before that. I was in it for six years. Uh, but I only spent on active front about a year. Uh, and in 2007, I transferred over. And that's probably one of the <laughs> better decisions I've made in my life. Probably. Which front did you get? Like, Afghanistan? Afghanistan, yeah. That's probably a good thing that you transferred. It was shortly after where I was hired to assassinate a Marine general. I'm oh, sorry, Major. Really? Yeah, he was one of the worse off ones. I'm gonna roll to I'm see sure if Castle he... heard about this. <laughs> um, you know, but before you do, because you, you get a bonus if I give you more information. Um, did you hear about the riots in. Um. Bangshinan? It's a township. Mm. But on um, the cups of being a city. Um, at Marine FOB nearby, the Marines were doing things with the local, for lack of a term, governor of the area. General, Major, sorry, was shot. Then all hell broke loose. Or wait, did you say he gets bonus for hearing out these stories? I, I, I'd imagine because, you know. I'll give him his full. Try, try on the Oh shit, I only meant to roll the last two. So oh, it would have still, been one success. Still one success. And he's like, well, shit, yeah, I did hear about that. There were a lot of injuries. <laughs> she nods her head and is like, we actually. I did it. Now you know why I'm a world wanted criminal. <laughs> well, damn. And we'll say that's my fun fact. Shot. Ooh, that was almost a crit <laughs> sale. One success. God, he just, as he's putting, he's like, small world. Same place, same time, just so happened to transfer out before that. Or at least transfer to a different front. Hmm. At the very least, you'll be happy to know that I wasn't involved in the riot. It turned out later on that my benefactor was coaxing a rebellion at that exact same time. The civilian major would have assisted greatly, but the Marines were able to, with the governor's men, restore order with many casualties. Benefactor, after I got well, they got caught. What happened to him? Well, the cell leader of the 
rebels spoke about him to get a lighter sentence. No idea what that was, to be honest. Probably a quick death rather than a painful one. And told them who was funding them. And, well, that was dealt with quickly. Plus, well, it turned out later on that the major was a bit on the corrupt side, so he the didn't grins. get that much fresh coverage. Hmm. Soldiers, how they did. Yeah. He Praise points. America. <laughs> he he looks he looks at the course and he says America, come on, put <laughs> there. Oh. I was Caps, it. distracted, I guess. Keep telling yourself that. I will, because it's true. As he says as he She rolls her eyes and then says, I know I know I'm stunning the moonlight. <laughs> takes a shot at your seduction to, you know, reduce your effectiveness. What? Get out of yeah. here! I'm going to make you lose by the score. If you, if you pull this, Charlie, I'm going to pull something on you. <laughs> Five successes, Cass. Oh, fuck you, I'm burning a willpower. <laughs> I'm risking it. You're gonna risk it? I'm gonna fucking risk it so I can get my willpower back. There. You have like full willpower, though. No, I don't. Yeah, you do. I'm no. looking at your sheet. I, I have the vacation willpower recorded on his character sheet. Oh, okay. Um, so. 10 days. Oh, fuck you. Oh, it's a crit fail! <laughs> God, so, uh, stupid sexy Charlie. Mine is a rule by five. <laughs> my alcohol roll? No, not, not your alcohol roll, your, your butt roll. Well, I failed the alcohol roll too. So now you're really hot and I'm pretty drunk. <laughs> Charlie knows what she is. I imagine there's like a Rue somewhere nearby going. <laughs> nah, Rue's off doing his own thing. <laughs> um, the council takes the shot. He just <sighs> okay. Next, next one. Let's go. Well, I'm, I'm waiting for you to tell your oh. interesting fact. Oh shit. <laughs> okay, okay. Interesting fact, interesting fact. I came out to my dad just this, uh, last week. But you're fine. Yeah. What's her to come out of that? Not solely liking women. Oh, he's one of those. Well, okay. it, it makes sense. Latino. Spanish. I'll give it to you, I'll give it to you free. Uh, I could have saved this for an additional fact, but fuck it. Whatever. Uh, my family is very, very, very religious. Ah. Uh. Are, are you exiled from the family? Is that why you're here? I'm not exiled from the family. He he came around. Surprisingly. Small things? She says for I think. He nods. No. No, I'm at like severe negatives now, dude. I'm at like negative three now. <laughs> I have to roll four fucking dice in order to... It's not possible. He's just like, fuck. Wait, I- no, never mind, I'm sorry, let me re-roll that, I forgot I'm at negative five. Let me try that again. Okay, let's- let's save it the negative five for only the one roll when she seduced him. I didn't ro I haven't done one with the negative five yet. God. But ironically enough, with the negative five, I got one success. 
Nice. Also, I'm going to roll Charlie's at a three, because, you know, it's, it's been a little while. Mm -hmm. Ooh, okay, so oh, God, Charlie's probably, here. Charlie's probably as, you know, drunk in this one. We're at the, we're yeah. at the same place. Yeah, we're at the same place, so. Negative three for all of Charlie's rolls from this before. It's <laughs> seven. The castle doesn't even say anything when he doesn't get it in his time. He just motions over for the drink. <laughs> what's, what's, drink. The, what's the score? Five, five. Oh, shit, we're tied. And and if we count the actual score. Oh, fuck. No, I know. Get out of here. <laughs> if we count the actual score, I'm just... He just looks at Charlie and shakes his head. Mm. <laughs> oh, that's how you play golf. Fuck. It's mini golf. Doesn't count. Am I still rolling to see if I get like absolutely shit faced? Are we just continuing this down the hole? Let's let's just you know. Uh, up to you. I don't want us to just like you know pass out drunk. Right. But like I, I imagine it, getting after two, two more drinks there. after this, I think we'll have to roll again. Yeah. Um. So he'll drink. Interesting that. She kind of leans on the <laughs> butt, butt. Sure, sure. Oh, something funny now. Huh? Oh, you're no. laughing. I am full of alcohol. <laughs> I just thought you were full of uh, vinegar, entirely to be honest. <laughs> No, there's, there's your fact. I'm just, it's already coming out. More alcohol I drink. I am a, what do they call it? A happy giggly drunk. Now I know. So if I start, if something's funny, I don't know why it is. <laughs> A lot of funny things. Mm -hmm. Then she kind of like walking to the thing. She kind of quite suddenly pushes out her for, you know, being somewhat tipsy. She still has some decent hand eye coordination. She like stops you with her putt putt pushing mm -hmm. her underneath the uh, castle's chin and kind of pushes him up a bit says, just wait there. I don't want any distractions. Winks. Close her eyes. She goes to putt. Not nine dice, seven dice. Three successes. Oh, enjoy your seven fucking dice. Don't you have, like, I have four, four dice, dice now? <laughs> you can't win. <laughs> oh, I'm at six. You're at uh, yep. Mark it down. It's not fair. You, I'm not allowed to be your distraction, but you're allowed to be mine. Rolls his eyes. <laughs> well, I gotta win somehow. Besides, it's not my fault that you're so easily. That you so fair. easily. And it's coming back around. Castle's easy. Oh, no, I'm not. <laughs> I can say you're easy, but if you want to interpret that that way, there just... are there have been others who have. I get that a lot. <laughs> he drinks. Uh, so should I roll again because it's two more, or the one after this? Let's say the one after this. Okay. All right, all right, all right. Castle fact number six. Yep. Right. Okay. Uh. She's, you know, practicing her swimming. Don't hit me. Well, don't stand so close. I am dangerous. <laughs> Focus on the ball. Alright, alright, alright. Fact number six. I've always liked cities. I think that. 
that kind of <laughs> kind of humdrum, the constant movement. There's something really nice about it. But I'm really, I'm starting to come around to nature more. I think. I'll admit I wasn't a fan of it originally. I thought there wasn't much to it, but. Well, when you work on the foundation, you see all sorts of things in nature. You start to appreciate it. You really do. Then she <laughs> swings. She kind of cheated this time, Reppin, you know, going through the course. She went up a little hill and skipped a bunch of course. Hey. And she bounced it just right off, like, something. Hey. It stayed in the it stayed in the boundaries. That's a leap hit. Yeah, well, I'm following the rules. I'm going over the foothill. Here I go. Tap, tap. Looks at her. Okay. Taps it in the hole. Give me my shot. <laughs> Gives him the shot. <laughs> I'm running out of facts. My, I'm getting. Just... Oh, do I would beat you? No, I don't pull through, man. He says as he like shakes his head at her like I'm not gonna pull through Charlie. <laughs> Drinks. What am I at? Three dice now. Oh I my god, so. he's good. <laughs> okay. Castle fact number seven. Seven. Don't actually, uh... <laughs> she, su she, she suddenly gets a glint in her eye, one that you haven't seen before as you get what she doesn't say. When what? Um, right as he begins talking, he, she gets a sudden glint in her eyes after she just thought of something. Hmm. It's funny they called me. You know, I got the call sign Dr. Diablo, because I'm a Satanist. But I don't actually believe, you know, before coming into the Foundation, I don't believe- I didn't believe in Satan. I don't- We still Dude. not believe in him? Uh, he probably exists. God exists. What the fuck? <laughs> Angel exists. <laughs> what the fuck? She gestures to her scar. What? No, it, it, you, you have enough classification. Yeah. You know what? No. I'll save this for when- Oh, it's fuck. You're, you're never going to beat I'm, me again. Uh, I'm so going. I'll never have to tell you. Oh. He, he he reached <sighs> over and he just pat like pats a finger on the scar and he says, "I'm going to figure this out. Just give me a bit." And then she covers his lip and says, "Shh, shh, shh, shh." Sashi, you know, and then she puts hand to his chest and pushes him back. You're in my putting space. Hands up. Steps away. No! And she's just like, this is why I need to stay on my putting space. No, I'm just, he's just so good looking. So distracting. He says he puts. Fuck. <laughs> Speak ill and get trapped. Fuck, where, where's it going? <laughs> he said, like, it goes off the course and he's just like. Where... Oh. There it is over there, right behind me. He, he just, How did he think it's behind him? No. I don't, he picks it up and he just drops it in the hole. Ta da. I'm going to count it as an extra 10. Oh. <laughs> Couldn't you just look away and said I did it while you weren't looking? Had to be a lie. Not allowed to lie. Oh. You were allowed to lie, technically. So he picks up the shot. Eight to five drinks. So for the ones that win, she circles the person that counted in first. Just so that it's, it's easy to keep track of, even if she also keeps track of the score. Mm -hmm. You don't need you don't need to roll this time, remember? Oh, I don't need to roll this time. Okay. Yeah, so we won't count it yet, okay. unless you want to. I mean, it, he is technically still drank in that many drinks. Yeah. Castle has taken eight shots. <laughs> I know. <laughs> it's a lot of shots. 
That is a lot of shots. I think rolling after this point is fair. Okay. And he takes his shot and he just is like, Oh my god. <laughs> going to forfeit? <laughs> no. All right. Let me just put it again. <laughs> this shit. Well, I um, didn't even give my facts. Oh, you didn't, and we're not going to count that one then, as she, she completely whiffs it. What? No! <laughs> Come on! <laughs> I need that. I need that. Well, you, you didn't please, give me a fact, so... Please, no. Puts his hands together? Come on. I need that fact. I'll think about it. Hmm, okay. It's gotta be a good fact, then. It better be. It's going to determine if I whiff that or not. Okay. Even... okay, okay. Even though, uh... We're just... We're starting as friends. I certainly... Would have no problems if you wanted to join me tonight. She laughs. She. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fucking drunk. <laughs> You're very drunk. And then she slowly, seductively walks forward. But she. Gets very close. She moves Makes away from touch. lips to whisper in the ear. I don't think that considers us an interesting castle. In fact, I already knew that. And she leans back and boots him on the nose. She has a playful smile. <laughs> But, E for effort. So I don't... We're re-putting then. He says, looking oh, yes. at the whiffed. <laughs> oh, yes. I'll just enjoy the view then. <laughs> he says from back there. <laughs> she rolls her eyes. What's your brother going to say? Probably nothing good. Is that your girlfriend? We're gonna definitely say that. And what are you going to tell him? Uh, she says, trap question. You, he, he can see the smile on her face and the, like, yes, that's a trap question, Castle. What are you gonna say about it? <laughs> he looks over his shoulder and says, she's got a beautiful smile and a great personality. Sugar lips, honey tongue. Oh, how dare you! <laughs> um, what do I have to roll? I always uh, forget that. Uh, it is. Uh, manipulation social plus have empathy versus presence composure. Guess whose social so has increased? Points at self. It's me. No. Uh, I have zero socialized. Uh, presence calm. I know, I actually have two so yeah. It's not your socialize, it's your presence comp. Okay, presence comp, that's okay. Nine dice. Oh, and I, Remember and I get minuses. minuses to it. Mm -hmm. I get three minuses to it. We're at six dice. Oh! Alright, well, give me a sec. I still have to roll mine. Monster. Don't forget your minuses, bastard. I don't have minuses, I have pluses because it's socialize. Oh! <gasps> Bastard. Alright, so it is present. I like 
I like that it's just when this song comes on. Mm-hmm. Manipulation, social, have done for three, round it up. So, four, six, seven, eight. Don't you have a, a coffee modifier, negative O? Or does your socialize just neglect that? Uh, no, I, I do have the minus coffee modifier. Yeah. Ah, I still got it. <laughs> no, we'll uh, reroll. No, I'm not going to. <laughs> Knowing my life, I'll just crit fail the next time. So a beautiful smile and a wonderful personality. Mm-hmm. What he just says. A beautiful smile and a great personality. And, and a few other things. Well. Tell me how, how, how great I am at I might just consider. <laughs> Go on. I'm waiting. Oh, 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 I'm listing now? Yes. Oh. We can say that that's your punishment for not giving any good fact. <laughs> oh, I told you before, I think you're gorgeous. Mm, tell me more, tell me. Great. <laughs> Also, you still need to putt. I, oh, am I, is it my turn? Is it mine? I can't yeah, multitask. Yeah. You want me to tell you how great you are, or you want me to putt? I want you to do both. Oh, well, that sa saunters up. She stands by her ball. That's already been knocked in. Honestly, it took her a few strokes, but she it did it. blows my mind how good you are at painting. You really picked it up, and I am blown away by it. Those pictures you sent me, I mean, I could tell from them you were not having a great time. But I was, was very upset. It, you are talented, Charlie. If you ever got the, out of the foundation, I think you could legitimately be an artist. I can think of a few other psychopaths that, um, if only they were artists, they wouldn't have become a psychopath. <laughs> I'm looking at you, A.L. He liked to draw nature paintings as well, you know. Yeah, that's, oh, that's true, but I would not be likening yourself to that. Two successes on the course. Yeah, Charlie wins. And then she's like, oh, well, a good effort, but I won. Was that the final hole? Well, um, I won this hole. We're only on 14 holes. Oh, that's Wait. getting there. I'm getting there. Cast the fact to number nine. <sighs> Am I taking the shot? And the shot. Well, if you don't think you can handle it. Oh, now he, oh, he, he raises it up. I'm definitely feeling it. That's not my fact, that's just a statement. <laughs> no, I was going to say that's a pretty pissed fact. Oh. I'll give whatever facts I want. <laughs> he says he drinks. It needs to be an interesting cast fact. Everything about me is That's interesting. <laughs> well, you see, you don't have what a... The fuck? You don't have a mysterious complexion like oh, I do. I don't ha I'm not mysterious. That's no. a lie. I You're am... kind of a square... And then, uh, as she says square, she, like, takes her arms and, like, <laughs> and, like kind of draws a square shape in her, like, in her vision. And you're short. Oh. Runs in the family. Well, I noticed that when you're sitting there. He's even smaller than you. <laughs> He's pretty short. Her sisters are even shorter. Uh... Alright, interesting castle fact number god knows what. Nine. Nine. Keep up with the program, Doctor. <laughs> oh, there's a fun fact. Uh, I finished most of my doctorate out of the hospital. Uh, after While I was... you were recovering. I, I spent a long time recovering after I was diagnosed. And, uh, fuck it, I... Double fact. I my other fact was shit. Technically, evidently, according to the jury. So uh, I am judge, jury, and executioner. <laughs> and then she, you know, takes out a fake 
and then takes out like as if she has a gun. She doesn't point it at him and says, "Bang." He holds his chest out. Oh, uh, so I don't. I mean, obviously, it's known there's something wrong, and that's why I've had more kidneys than anyone has any right to have kidneys. Uh, it's called. Oh, those poor kidneys. They're dead. They're gone. They're not coming back. Uh, it's called glomerulonephritis. Uh, Bright's disease, <laughs> for short. Uh, and pretty much when I was uh, taken out, I, I had to leave the army. I was dismissed because I was diagnosed and I was very sick, right? Uh, and I was actually in and out of the hospital for a couple years like long-term stay uh, so the uh, online schooling was just coming around and I was like screw this <laughs> uh, if I'm gonna if I'm gonna be stuck in here and if I just spent so many years healing and stitching people back together I'm going to get a degree in healing and stitching people back together it just so happened that that degree, uh, more translated to doing it mentally. <laughs> How's that for a fact? She. What'd you say, Chance? Uh, she nods. You're standing. So it went from being a a jarhead to a corpseman and then a fist. Pretty much. I'll say that that's interesting. Not as not mysterious, but interesting. I believe it's my turn to putt again. I think it is your turn to putt. Prepare to lose castle. <sighs> And then she puts, and she got cocky. He goes over, like this passes her. <sighs> Might like gently bump her. <laughs> puts it, <laughs> and so she drinks. He's at four. One success. All right, let's hear about that scar. So, she says, walk towards the thing, and then she, off first, she lifts up her skirt a bit, you know, not, she, she kind of plays around making it a bit seductive, but, you know, she's wearing bikini bottoms underneath, and mm -hmm. she gestures to a nasty-looking scar. Surprisingly clean, but still pretty nasty, like, it's about three, four inches long, and maybe an eighth of an inch wide. It's a big scar. Jeez. That was a spear that impaled my leg and the way through. Just missed the archer. Jeez. If she had twisted it and ripped it out, well, I'd probably have lost the entire leg. But she decided to just rip it out. Stab and yank it out. It was not a very good experience. Uh, this was when I was a P class in penal unit. We went to go and capture or kill a knight of a round table. Oh, of course, naturally. Na naturally. Except he was a reincarnation of one, I honestly. His. Which one he is exactly slips my mind. I'm sure I'll figure it out. <laughs> Gonna call it the haze, but we found. I think it was Camelot. I think. You think? Because it was a. Oh, I don't know what it was, but it's cert It's no architecture I've ever seen before, and I've seen a lot of architecture. It was also a metropolis, a medieval metropolis. Cam Camelot was a medieval metropolis. So was Paris, but we weren't in Paris. And, well, 
there was a group of cultists there who were servants of the Weeping Angel, something like that. And basically, these cultists rescued this knight around table, got him his sword, and they, with him, were going to, from what I understand, resurrect the Pendragon and cause some chat. And there was a bunch of angels who were on their side. Oh, about of course. four of them. Four of them in total. We killed two, and the other two got got away. And boy, were they difficult to kill. My goodness. So, I encountered one inside a cathedral. Mm -hmm. Some big cathedral. This place rivaled the. Uh, Notre Dame, that's how big this cathedral is. Oh, okay. And this is a subterranean city. So we're somehow. talking big fuck off cathedral. Big fuck off cathedral. And <laughs> when I first saw her, my teammates and I froze. He even knows it was a she. It was a horror. Something the mind couldn't comprehend, but then we were able to whatever let us see through her veil, her disguise, I guess, but it's really not a disguise. It's, it's weird. As soon as that shattered, we saw her as an angel, a attractive angel. I guess old angels would be attractive. And she was clad in gold armor, gold spear. My companions never broke out of that stupor until we fought. I shot her with a grenade launcher. It did nothing. Nothing at all. Nothing. Nothing at all. Okay. She. It hit her right in the chest. There was the explosion, and then she flung at me. I dodged. She wasn't trying to hit me. So... I lit her up full automatic at point blank range. Bullets just bounced off of her flesh. So. Hit her moral of the story is angels are fucking scary. Oh, yes. Um, we dueled a bit, if you even call it that. <laughs> um, she honestly was toying with me. She could see into my very soul all the sins I've committed. It was quite horrifying, really. And then she... Well, she got cocky after she ran me through her spear. And I stabbed her in the eye. Good. You see, lead doesn't do anything. But iron does. Oh. And so, so does steel. A bit. I didn't know that at the time. I just tried to stab at something that seemed like something that do it. something. Something that do something. And I, I did. She didn't like that. I got flung into a pillar. I was knocked unconscious. Um, when I woke up, there was a crack in this pillar, and most of my rooms were broken. Um, flash forward a near the end of a mission where we, well, my, where my team, Ooh, sorry, my the other supporting teams, the recovery team that we helped save and the MTFs that had arrived on site were all converging on the fortress. Like, it was an actual castle. We were besieging a castle, and most of us didn't have ammo anymore, so we're using swords and axes. It was horrific. Imagine being in the modern day, and you're using a sword and a shield because you ran out of ammo two days ago. It was horrific. <laughs> And it got even worse. These shields could block bullets. D d what? Yes. It was insane. That's, that's A couple only supposed of these... to exist in the Marvel movies. Yes. These, most of the cultists didn't have it, but some of them started to arm themselves in the uh, Arithian, I guess, era weapons and armor, and they were bulletproof. It wasn't like, oh, it, it dense. Bulletproof doesn't even leave a scratch. <laughs> it, it, it was so weird. 
<laughs> the MTFs, like however, shit. had weapons that could actually punch through the armor, anti-material rifles, and things like that. That's how we killed two angels, the big guns. Um, one of them just dived bomb, and its head ceased to exist. The other one tried to fly away, and its one of its wings got blown off, and then it was beaten to death. My team and I, and one of the other uh, Ember Recovery team, oh. snuck in, and... Oh. Okay. Hello? Hello, is this Rihanna? Back. This is. I figured it was. Are you at door? Okay. I am here. I don't know. Can I park on the street? Is that allowed? Uh, it's so long as it says there's there, check out for signs. If there's no sign saying don't, you should be good. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, just do a quick. Is the. Okay, well, is the. Uh, is the. Uh, street curb next to you, yellow? No. Then you should Wait. be good. You can't really call this so I'm gonna get out of the car. <laughs> <laughs> but either way, like, I'm here. Alright, so. I'll see you in a bit. Uh, well, I don't, can you... Yeah, I'm gonna come oh, outside. Okay. Yeah. Alright, bye, bye. Yep, bye. All right, to be continued. <laughs>